It's good. Hey family, today is January 8th and it's Sunday, the start of week two um, of my progress or with my New Year's resolution goals. Um, I am studying my word. I'm in Exodus. Here it is. Studying the word. Got my stuff together and it's been going good. Um, I am on chapter two studying that. So just wanted to again update you on my progress for week two. Bye-bye. Hello family. Hey. Today is January 9th, week two, and I am reporting that I am with my Bible, doing my Bible study. I'm in Exodus chapter four, um, just reviewing that some more, and then I um, may go into five, but I'm just, four was a, um, I just had, I wanted to be able to restudy that a little bit more, so I went back. Um, so I may go into five, but right now it's four. Okay, just wanted to update you on my progress. All right, bye. Hey, family. Hi. Hey, I just wanted to update you on my progress. Um, today is January. 11th and the struggle is real yeah the struggle is real you know how you face it seems like every time you try to set a goal for yourself or things like that then that's when the temptation starts rolling in and I mean you know that but you know that's when it becomes rolling in and that has happened to me um, this week. Um, I did fall short and um, eat some candy and ate some chips. So, um, yeah, like I said, the struggle is real. But... I am with what it is is you got to fight through and I know that before because when I had um, in the past you know try to live a healthy lifestyle and uh, really focused on it because I had in the past um, when I had uh, really tried to eat right I had did eight months straight without cheating at all on anything besides my meal plan um but afterwards you know you felt like you just wanted to binge and stuff so I mean that was I still felt like I needed some type of cheat but since then I'm just trying to figure out how that works it's hard to figure out um, how to incorporate that cheat um, so um I think I don't know. I got to do it where, because that also too, when you get older, it's harder to lose too. It's not as easy. And it just seems like you lose in different places. It just seems like every time that you go back to a healthier diet, um, the older you get over the years, it just seems like it does differently than before. So I'm going to really have to sacrifice. Um, I'm going to really have to buckle down and do that. So, um, you know, like I said, I check in, you know, every day with little clips of my progress. So I'll keep you informed. I'll give you the 
you know, the good and the bad. So like I said, so far, and I've been working out and stuff, like you'll see, I've been doing my working out, I mean, you know, more than I, you know, thought I would, um, at least probably like three times a week or something. Um, but in my eating good, it's just incorporating, adding that other little small junk. Um, so, and again, I don't want to have it where I work out in vain and then, you know, I'm not really showing any results. So... Um, we'll see how this rest of this week goes. I'm going to today, um, for the rest of this week, cause my new week starts on Sunday. So Saturday is the last day. I'm going to, um, try to get some more workouts in and, you know, not cheat. And I do have like blueberries and things like that, that, um, going to be eating. Like whenever I feel that urge, just, you know, eat those blueberries. So, hey, just here, you know, being real and trying to motivate you this week. So if you're struggling this week, hey, it's okay. It happens. It's because you're trying to make a change. And that's why that temptation, that struggle is coming your way. But you got to fight through it. Try to get that inner strength and um, press through. So I'm with you um, and I'll keep you posted. All right. Bye-bye. Hey, family. I am out on a Thursday um, at a little um, event downtown Pittsburgh at a lounge so I don't know if I can record any of it but I did want to um, say hi and I will catch you in a couple minutes but I just came back from the office. I was there from nine o'clock in the morning till it's now 2.30. And, um, you know, trying to knock out some of my um, to-do lists, which I started on. But what I'm figuring out what I have to do now is um, I'm probably going to have to do that to-do list maybe at a, um, like, a, uh, Panera Bread or um, some place where I'm more secluded so I can knock that out. Or maybe I'll just sit, no, or I'll go to the office but I'll sit in like a conference room or something. Yeah, I'll do that. Um, so I can really knock it out. Because I meant to knock it out today and I did start, but I got sidetracked. Um, but I did get um, a potential, another potential buyer. Um, and stuff and then just catching up on some other stuff but knocking some stuff out at work um, and what else um, and as far as with um, my physical I'm still struggling I'm having a struggling week and you know again I want to be able to report this because um, 
I think this is what happens when you have these, this is why these New Year's resolutions never stick hardly. There's probably, a, I don't know what the percentage is, I should look that up, but the percentage of people that actually keep their New Year's resolution. Um, I'm, I'm assuming it's pretty low because I know I never um, kept any of mine, so, um, or did I? Maybe, maybe one. No, not a New Year's resolution, no. But, um, so it, it is real. I mean, second week, first week was pretty okay. This second week is like, you know, it's not like I'm eating a whole bunch or whatever, but I'm, um, I don't know. I just, I guess the older you get, it just gets hard to really focus in, you know, um, well, that's my excuse. I, don't know. I just noticed, I know before it was seemed like it was, um, easier, but again, I'm trucking along, I'm trucking along. So, um, but let's see what else today, what other, um, thing. Yeah, I think that's about it. Um, I'm a little tired today, so, but again, I'm checking in, I'm, you know, checking in, so. I hope this motivates you. If you are have, if you are struggling, don't give up. Don't feel guilty. Don't feel bad about it. It happens. Um, again, this is these are the reasons why we're not fulfilling those New Year's resolutions. But we got to push through the struggles, which is just emotional stuff, the fears, the insecurities, the um, the doubt, the anxiety, um, whatever it is. We got to push through it and. Um, Take each day at a time and try to accomplish our goals. All right, well, that is it. And I'll check you out on the next clip.